Hey, good morning. Welcome to my first English tutorial where I will show you how I create my spreads and teach you the basic elements of my creative process. In my book, I explain in details about the seven elements and these videos will accompany the book. I did this spread as a contribution to my sister-in-law. She is a musician and she needed artwork for her catalogs of concerts. Unfortunately, the original was lost when I sent it to my graphic designer, but at least I had a scan of it, so I was able to still use it in my book. I started this spread with the intention that it will be about the piece The Red Violin. But very quickly it became a piece about my memories, my life. The Red Violin is a story about a violin that passes from family to family over countries and generations. For me, it reminded me the story of my brother and my father. When my young brother was one and a half years, my parents discovered that he was very talented with the cello. He started playing and became kind of a wonder child. My father encouraged him and was very proud of him. But sadly, when my brother turned 10, my father died suddenly, and it was a trauma for all of us. My little brother continued playing the cello, partly because he believed it was my father's will. Only recently, he decided to give up a professional career and try to do the things that he really wanted to do. So I started to collage with this story in my mind. That was my intention, to connect and find what I feel around this very emotional family story. When I started looking for images, I freed my mind and just let myself pick whatever I loved. I let myself connect to my unconscious mind, that part of me that knows the message I needed to get from this spread. So now I invite you to go and choose a poem, a story, a movie that touches your heart and think about it for a while and then look for images that re represent this piece of art for you. You don't have to, to do it uh, in a very organized way. Just let your heart guide you and choose images that you love.